So hey guys, I just want to come back on here and kind of show you that I did clean this, this part right here quite a few times with Clorox wipes. And uh, I went through my crystal basket and I have uh, kind of cut it down to like to one fourth of what I had. And I'm selling quite a bit in this glass jar over here, glass container over here. And um, right now I'm just letting it, I put, I cleansed them with Reiki, salt, herbs, um, some of my Daydreamer spray, which has chamomile and lavender in it. And then I also blessed it with um, two incense, Lakmish and Ganesha. So they are just kind of soaking up their natural energies, getting reprogrammed um, to a clean slate. So then whoever buys them can reprogram them. And I just felt really guided by my guides and angels to let them sit here for as long as they need, probably until someone purchased them. And then uh, I'm gonna give them a business card, the crystals that they buy in a silk pouch. So they'll get the crystal business card, the silk pouch, some Dead Sea Salt, some pink Himalayan sea salt, um, a sage, like a little couple sage leaves like this that have not been burned that are pure and some olive leaves and then like corresponding herbs such as jasmine and lavender uh, and I'm gonna put little pieces of pyrite chips and a little bit of rose quartz or blue kyanite chips at the bottom so they'll the crystals will be embedded with these energies to kind of sit there and absorb these energies whenever they need to be replenished or reprogrammed um that way i know that they're coming from the highest vibration because the person that i bought it from they were kind of i don't feel that they came to me in the most at the time it was a very difficult time for the person that gave it to me and I had to set them in water and salt for several days and then uh, now they're completely back to where they're supposed to be and I want to keep it like that so that I might put in some care instructions as well so then that way they don't get any funky energy attached them again. So I'm just making sure that they are I can just put my hands above this and I can just feel the energies pulsing with Reiki healing because I in, I program them to their original vibration and then I imbued Reiki in it. So you can just, between that and the salt and the herbs, it's just an amazing vibration. It's almost like a generator right now with all these crystals. So I'm just gonna keep them here and every once in a while replenish them with reiki and incense smoke and so when they're ready to be packaged and being rehomed that they stay in this position you know uh and i feel when i do my reiki it's lifelong when i put it in objects because i always pray over them for it to be that way so if someone even when they replenish it the reiki will still be there it'll just be a little bit stronger when they cleanse them so I feel like this is just what I need to do I need to get rid of these crystals because they have been wanting new homes for some time and I'm hoping the person that buys them enjoys them as much as I did and I just have not been working with them and I want my collection to be more intimate and right now it's just kind of over the top <laughs> and it was over the top before and now it's just getting to that same energy of I'm not using what I have so I really just want to make sure that these get the correct home so if you're interested I will be posting each individual crystal on my website 
you can pay me through PayPal and it's secure. It'll come with, you know, two to three days shipping. It'll probably come in a padded envelope unless you buy the whole pack, then I might have to do a small box. But I just feel like these are just wonderful crystals. There's a lot of healing energies, a lot of angel energies, a lot of clairvoyant dream energy. Like I said, just a ton of protection and prosperity and abundance. And like this was a this would be a great starter pack, honestly. And I just feel these crystals are very special to me, but I just need to start fresh. And I want them to get the respect that they deserve because right now it's kind of, before I cleanse them, they were in a position where it would kind of not really trigger me negatively, but it would make me a little sad. So I wanted to make sure that these energies are full of happiness and joy and blessings and that's exactly how they feel right now they don't even feel like the same crystals but i know it's because they're ready to go and they're not mine anymore and so nothing that came from the previous owner or from me is attached to these crystals anymore so that is a blessing in itself so i will be posting the whole collection on my website along with the individual crystals if you don't want to buy the whole collection and I do have two decks right now that I'm selling and it might grow it might not but you can always custom order courses healings readings products for me I do a lot of Reiki products I like to make tea lights Reiki sprays um, mojo bags sleep bags and I just really love to create it. I can make you like a a painting with Reiki infused in it. I can do your aura painting with Reiki infused in it. I can just about create anything that you need if it comes from that kind of intention of healing and possibility. You know, I'm someone that does make and scent blends, but it's not the stick kind. It's the loose herbal and I also make roll-on oils, but they are either from extra virgin olive oil or coconut oil. And so I put them in roll-on bottles. And again, I just try to really make everything my own. It might not be aesthetically over the top or look like, uh, like a lot of these professional witches, but it does come with a high vibration and a pure, authentic, beautiful place in my heart. And I really do a lot of praying over it, making sure that it is at the highest vibration so that it'll stay that way when the person gets it. And even after months and years after they've had it. And if you're someone that feels like anything that you've got for me needs to be replenished you know i will be happy to replenish it for you if you for instance if you had reiki spray and you feel like the bottle didn't keep the intent that i had for it to be filled back up i can always bring send you a new bottle you know uh i just really enjoy what i do and i want it to be my life purpose in a way that is more full time and less sporadic. And I really am wanting to make this a, not only a life career, but a life path in a way that not only helps me, but those around me. And I'm ready. I'm ready for that, uh, that change and whatever comes with it, you know. So I will be working on my website and always know if you are someone that wants to sample something, you know, with little to no price, let me know. It'll only be a one-time thing. Uh, if you are someone that needs an actual Reiki session, you have no money, I will do a free Reiki session with a review. No money needed, but when you come back for your second one, I will expect you to 
pay like everybody else, but I try to do the Good Samaritan thing as much as possible just because I believe in karma and I believe in good karma and I also just believe that people deserve that chance of being heard, you know. And if you're someone that, you know, is doing it to take advantage, I, like I said, I, that's not for me to judge. It is what it is. Move on, you know. Um, but again, I won't, I don't want it to become a expect, expecting energy. Um, one and done for me, you know, I'll, I'll lend out a hand if you need it. Uh, but I love and respect you guys and I really want you to see that in my products and I hope that you love and respect what I do and that you find a lot of joy out of it and you get the results that you want you know so again I'm not promising perfect but I am promising real and authentic so I will talk to you guys soon and I will be back but look out for these products on my shop many blessings